we're at the airport once again. I love how time is just like not a concept in the airport. Everyone's just really doing their own thing. Dad. <laughs> the vlog. Tell them where we're going. Why? Where are we going? I'm going to San Tropez. I think this flight is going to be like 10 hours. So, I'm going to have a glass or three before. Oh my god. <laughs> this actual 12 year old boy was just staring at me. <laughs> Fresh off the plane. We haven't even gone to our Airbnb yet. I just literally had to get so handy outside with this Airbnb thing. Like the key was in this like what do you even call it? Like hatch? <laughs> and I couldn't like pry it open because there's no handle on it. It's just like a flat wooden thing like in the wall. So I was taking my laces from my sweatpants, like sliding it underneath and then like trying to pull it. I just felt very fucking like an engineer. But Airbnb tour, the AC is mad loud, but at least it's cold in here. Got one bed over there, one bed over there. It's just cute, it's like simple. A little bathroom. And the outside, I feel like just like the streets and the windows and everything here is the cutest, but. We gotta figure out how to make that more quiet. I wish. Look who crashed the family vacay. <laughs> Always. <laughs> we took a little nap earlier because I was very jet lagged, but now we're heading to dinner. Oh my god, it's 9 p.m. You would never know. <laughs> it literally was so bad. <laughs> we just got to dinner. Ella has arrived. <laughs> no drink yet. I'm ready for some pasta. Dad and Ella's boyfriend actually ended up going out last night to the club, so we made them stay in a hotel room together and Ella and I had like a little sleepover. I'm getting ready for day two and I just was putting this on and I have to show you guys how obsessed I am with this product. My friend Katya got me this for my birthday this year and I'd never even heard of it before, but it's basically this Patrick Ta body glow and I wasn't into it at first because I was like, this is sticky, blah, blah, blah. There is nothing more than I like in the summertime than looking like sw like sweaty but like in a good way. Like I'm glowing when I put this shit on. Just watch, okay. See the stomach? I don't even know if this lighting will do it justice because you need like the sunlight to hit it. But I love putting it like on my shoulders, down, oh my god, do you see that? <laughs> down my arms. When I'm wearing a dress, I'll hit the legs. But... It also smells super yummy, so like it doesn't feel like it's like you need a shower after. It feels more like a moisturizer, and then after a few hours, it like absorbs. But just thought I'd put you all on. Oh my god, because you see, I'm hitting pan. I'm gonna have to buy some more of this because it's my new favorite. <laughs> Oh my god, should I get on my Euro vibe?
always. Because the glass bottle is so much better. And I'm discovering that I now like olives because I think you have to try them like multiple times. Oh, sorry. To like them. What? I need to really like them. Try these, they're so good. I like when the like seed or whatever is in it. And then they gave us these like little puff things to make a plan for. And I think I'm on to some to go try to get into that Asian place or So good. But I think we can go at 7 30, you know. already Gucci, Saint Laurent, uh, Otega. <laughs> I don't know there's so many stores here but they're all just fun to look at because the inventory in them is like very beach and resort so there's like fun limited edition things. Oh, let's just knock this over but the dinner restaurant we're at is porn star martinis. Sure. Okay, okay guys, I went absolutely feral in the souvenir stop store shop today. The jacket. Like, why is it giving praying vibes? I feel like anytime I step into, like, a tourist store in, like, Europe, I just become obsessed with all the tacky shit, and the tackiness becomes, like, camp. You know? So this is the jacket. I thought it was so cute. Like, little track number. And then freaking children's, like, mini skirt. I think I may have to cut the shorts out because they are cutting off the circulation of my thighs. But on the butt... It says Saint Tropez, French Riviera, literally so cute. And then the shirt that I'm wearing, I literally went insane, I'm telling you guys. It says Prince, Princesse Tropezine. Okay, I definitely said that wrong, but it means like Princess of Saint Tropez, I think. Good morning. I've been up for like, oh, not the side bang. I've been up for like two hours. Um, Ruby and I shot some photos this morning and then I went to the little coffee shop outside our Airbnb and they weren't open but he did make me a coffee and I felt bad because it was free and I was like not about to ask for like oat milk or anything I was like I'll get what I get not the biggest fan of black coffee but forcing myself to drink this because I'm pretty tired we just got ready because we're going to the beach club today, which is like a 20 minute drive. So we're going to spend like the day over there. And I had this outfit like off and it ended up being like 10 times cuter on. So I'll show you guys it. I'm wearing the Frankie's bikini, like Pamela Anderson collab. And then this is like a little slip dress, which actually came with matching like underwear. But I don't know how I would ever wear this, like not as a cover up. And you guys know me, I don't mind wearing like a sheer dress number. I don't mind being half naked, but this is like full naked. <laughs> so, we're doing it as a cover up. Jacques Mousse on the hat. My like XXXX boyfriend got me this hat, so thanks, bestie. <laughs> Gotta accessorize now. We made it to Club 55. Gorge. <laughs> they have chicken tenders. Oh, is it They're like meat? all in my spot. Mm. Delicious. So, <laughs> we have over ordered. Slightly. I thought we could have gone a bit light here. <laughs> I think you want light? I think I might have gone light. Should we get it? Should we get it? Okay, guys, showered off from the beach day. Here's the fit. Jacques Mousse shorts. I have no clue what this top is. And then I think my necklace is from Pilgrim Jewelry. Almost just burnt myself on that. Gorge. 
Good morning. Oh, here it comes. <laughs> wow. Some more Yeah, you're very to stay in last night while everyone was out until four <laughs> but my sister and James have departed so it's kind of just my dad and I chilling and Ruby I'm going to meet up with her this morning to do some work on our computer because we just haven't done that all week it's pretty hard to like find a place with Wi-Fi or like a restaurant that will let you have your computer out. I literally cannot find this place for the life of me. Like, I'm happy I caught up on sleep. I'm taking Ruby's shock moose stuff to her. And today's Bastille Day, which is like French independence, I believe. <laughs> It's funny because like I didn't even celebrate the 4th of July nor do like I care to celebrate the 4th of July but like the steel day, let's fucking get it. I was supposed to go down this street. I think this is like some crazy hotel. They're blocking off all the hedges. Um, there has been one celebrity sighting here. Zac Efron, <laughs> who's like my childhood dream crush. So that was exciting. He was with some um, comedian my dad knew, like Ross or something. I don't fucking know who the other guy was, but Zac Efron. Also, one thing I did notice, I don't think it's France, I think it's just Saint Tropez, is people do not like to move for you. Like if they're walking and you guys are walking towards each other, they expect you to step out of the way so they can continue to walk in their straight line. People aren't very accommodating and if you don't, you're getting a shoulder, sh shoulder shove. It's really annoying. But besides that, great place. I'm covered in mosquito bites per usual. Hi, so I'm back from the coffee shop. I was able to do a little bit of work, not exactly all, but I think I'm gonna head off to the beach clubs now because my dad and all of his like little buddies, he's on like a boys trip I swear, this is like my dad's escape every year, this is my first time coming and joining, um, but they're already at the beach club so I'm gonna go meet up with them. I'm wearing a jaded London little bikini. And then the little cover-up skirt is Frankie's bikinis and people I usually would just wear it like this like with my swimsuit top but people like are really weird here about like being having your cover up but it's so weird because like the restaurant where you eat is like on the beach with the beach chairs and there's people in their swimsuits but then like when you eat it's like frowned upon if you're not 
wearing your clothes, I feel like, which I'm just a little bit not used to it. I'm very chill like island life. I only wanna, even though we're not on an island, but like I just wanna like have my swimsuit on, my flip flops, my t-shirt and like, you know, I don't know, maybe I guess that's a little crazy. So this is my cover up instead. last day in San Tropez. My sister and Ruby have left. I'm very sad about it, but me and my dad are gonna have fun today and tomorrow. I just got ready. I slept in super late today because I haven't been sleeping here that well. Um, and they have like a little market on Tuesdays and Saturdays, so I'm gonna go see what's up with that. Sport in the Patrick Ta body glow that I just ran out of, so I need to go buy some more when I get back. And then maybe some more shopping today. And I did bring a book on this trip, so maybe I can actually read a few pages because I feel like I've been bringing it with me everywhere and just not opening it. So that's the plan today. This is my little scent. I'm wearing Salomon's because I want to be comfy at the market and it's like dirt, so I don't want my feet getting all dirty. But this set, um, I'm not sure the exact brand. I know you can buy it at Susan Alexandra in New York on Orchard Street. They have a ton of cute little like lace sets and dresses, but also they're known for like their beaded accessories and stuff, which is also really cute. Susan Alexandra shout out. <laughs> jewelry and I just got a nice sandwich from this place that I've been walking by the past few days. I'm tattooing them, they're tattooing me. <laughs> what are we gonna tattoo on? Is the question. Okay. Great time. Like okay. I've never felt more. 
Sweetheart. Gorgeous. Thank you. Thank you. Sassy, sassy bitch. What are we doing? What word? <laughs> sassy bitch. En plus, ça se met là, attends, sur un truc en face. Elle fait le feutre. Bonne soirée. Salut le vieux. On the end. One second, I, I will put the, ah oui. the light <laughs> on yes. the spot. Yeah. Right on the spot. Yeah. Ça fait super, ça fait super. Bah, quand t'as jamais fait, c'est très compliqué. Ah, ça fait, hein. Je fais comme ça, regarde ça. Push, push more. You have to push a little bit more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh no. That's okay. No, it's okay, it's okay. okay. It's perfect. <laughs> You need to stretch a bit more. Uh, Morgan, tu devrais stretcher avec un stretch pour aller. That's okay. Really nice. Montre. Candy boy. Wow. Allez, fais un bon. Oh, j'adore. Oh, you can push. No, no, no. no. That's really great. You guys can book me for inquiries. Hit the description if you want me to get tattooed. If you want me to tattoo you. This may or may not look like the word candy. That's one of my best tattoos. One of his best. I mean, that seems like a white lie for sure. The more unique, sure. But we'll go with it. <laughs> Last day, and I didn't wake up till 4 p.m. Name a more me thing. Um, clearly last night I was very drunk, I made some great memories with some great new French friends, but I did get a little aggressive thinking I can drink like a whole bottle and a half of wine to myself, so this morning wasn't that fun, and I did spend my last day glued by the toilet just puking this morning, I have to keep it honest with you guys. <laughs> I would actually kill someone for some Chick-fil-A right now. That's probably not good to say, but I'm obsessed with Chick-fil-A and not only am I in France where they don't fucking have it, but it's also Sunday, so there's just like no, no chance it's happening. Um, I'm gonna go to one last dinner and try to revive myself. And yeah, my flight's at like 9 a.m. or something tomorrow. My tattoo turned out beautiful. It says Petite Coer. I'm probably not saying that right, which is so embarrassing, but it means sweetheart in French is what I was told. So they got to pick out a French word to tattoo on me. And then I somehow convinced um, Sven to my new friend who let me tattoo him, tattoo him in exchange. The only difference is he's a tattoo artist, full-time career. I've never touched a tattoo gun in my life. <laughs> it was a very interesting ex- Ooh. You guys balancing on my pill bottle right now? <laughs> anyway, it was a great experience. I had fun. He said he was satisfied with the tattoo, so I'll take it. Um, it was rough around the edges, and I don't know why, but in my drunken state, I thought candy would be like a cute, a super cute American word to, to tattoo on him, which I kind of fuck with it, honestly. Kind of cute. But I guess, I don't know, I think I was just like, I love candy, let me tattoo candy. I don't know, I probably wanted some candy. <laughs> it was like trying, me trying to drop subtle hints. <laughs> um, okay, let's go eat. My body needs food. Set is from Song of Style, if anyone fucking cares. Hi guys. I once again forgot to do a little outro, but I just had the longest travel day of my entire life. I think I was up at like 5 a.m. France time. And now it's 10 p.m., 9.48 U.S., so it's probably like 3 a.m. in France. 4 a.m.? And I have only slept like 30 minutes, maybe. Haven't eaten since my Sunday dinner, and it's now almost Tuesday, so there's a lot going on. It was a very hectic day, long drives, a lot of delays, and... I don't know. I'm waiting for my Chick-fil-A to get here because I told y'all I was craving it like two days ago. So I got my Chick-fil-A and I'm signing off the vlog. I hope you enjoyed. I'm going to be starting a new vlog tomorrow morning because I'm moving apartments. So I'll see you guys in that one.